sexual reproduction. It is a process of one individual producing offspring that is genetically identical to itself. Thus, this reproduction only requires one parent to reproduce and mating process is not needed. A sexual reproduction occurs usually in unicellular organisms such as monorans and protists, in plants, and certain animals. The result of this reproduction process is the offspring is not only similar to one another but also exact copies of their parents. Such a group of morphologically and genetically similar individuals are called There are different types of asexual reproduction, and these are body. In this form of reproduction, the offspring grows out from the body of the parent. Examples of animals that exhibit this kind of reproduction are hydras. Gemules are internal buds. The parent releases a specialized mass of cells that can develop into an offspring. Sponge reproduce this way. Fragmentation. In this reproduction, the body of parent breaks into distinct pieces, and each of the pieces can transform or form as the offspring. Planarians exhibit this kind of reproduction. Regeneration. In regeneration, if a piece of parent is detached, it can grow and develop into a newly and completely formed individual. Echinoderms reproduces through this kind of process. Parthenogenesis. This type of reproduction involves the development of an egg that has not been fertilized. Ants, bees, and wasps that do not have any sex chromosomes reproduce this way. Some reptiles and fish are capable of reproducing. Asexual reproduction, of course, has its advantages and disadvantages. In the environment that it occurs, there are favorable and unfavorable results of it, maybe in the environment or the animals itself. A sexual reproduction can be very advantageous to certain animals. For example, there are animals that only stay in one particular place and are able to look for a mate that could be self Thus, they need to reproduce a sexual. Another advantage of it is, human race of offspring can be produced without costing a parent to be All of the species are genetically identical. Therefore, they have the same traits and so as weaknesses. Any negative effects in the parent, like disease or unfavorable environmental conditions, will affect all of the offspring as well. If the stable environment changes, the consequence will be detrimental. Asexual reproduction Another way of reproducing offspring for those species that do not have the capacity to look for males, for tail, or to those who do not have any sex chromosomes. Mostly, invertebrate animals exhibit this kind of reproduction, but some vertebrates also does if necessary. Reproduction is a marvelous combination 